was your name? Angela Anthony. How was your set tonight, Angela? It was so much fun. It was, yeah. Yeah, I had so much fun. Were you nervous? I was nervous. Uh, the nerves went away, but the adrenaline kicked in. Right. Yeah. Uh, how did the audience take to you? I think they liked me. I mean, my friends were here, so <laughs> that's like always helpful. Awesome. I'm glad. Oh, <laughs> yeah. This. <laughs> She'll be taking the class next. Okay. Well, the best part was coming to class and laughing my head off every week. And the worst part was when the jokes sucked that I tried to write. <laughs> but other than that, it's all fair game, and everyone is so encouraging and wonderful. Uh, I'll have to watch the video. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Um, we'll see. All right, well, then let's introduce your next comic. Welcome to the stage, Angela Anthony. Howdy. Oh, I can't see anyone. This is good. Okay. So I'm a stay-at-home mom. Yeah, so uh, that means I'm in therapy. But being a stay-at-home mom completely rocks because no one can fire me from my job. I've also been married 15 years. Yeah, that is a long time for our first marriage. <laughs> I love how men and women are completely different when it comes to sex. Like women, we like the build up, right? Kiss our necks a little bit, rub our back. But the only form of foreplay a guy needs is consent. <laughs> so said my husband. Oh, uh, my husband says I lose everything, but I told him I have no clue where Malaysian Flight 370 is. <laughs> we still like to do new things, like, you know, we're, we're, I don't know, we still like to try new things. So the other day we did our first line. <laughs> a credit. the fact that I'm never paying it back. Yeah, but I am in therapy. And I need to be because I haven't been to church in a long time. I feel a few things have been missing from my life since I've left church, like um, shame and judgment. Therapy for making me consciously aware that I'm paying $125 an hour to fuck up my kids' lives anyway. <laughs> Feel bad for my kids when I'm PMSing. My husband laughs. Feel bad for you too, but uh, let's add hormones to the fact that I'm already, I'm already a little domestically challenged. Little Jimmy brought cupcakes for the whole class today. Oh, Jimmy's mom did that? Okay, well, uh, Jimmy's mom's a cupcake-making bitch. <laughs> Kids are cute though, right? Thank God they are, because when they wake you up at five in the morning, the temptation runs across your mind to poof, hit snooze. Uh, no one warned me that having children completely messes up your hormones. Every time I popped another kid out, it's like they summoned a new chin hair. <laughs> By the time I'm done, I'm going to have a full Fu Manchu. <laughs> so what's the deal with guys' beards being so popular right now? The beard. The beard. Like, wh what are you guys hiding behind those chin curtains? <laughs> oh my god, it's herpes. <laughs> So I'm 35, and 35 is a really confusing age for me because I'm stuck somewhere in between young adult and denial. <laughs> but at this age, I realize I 
have to live with whom I become, so my new favorite craft beer name is If You're Hoppy and You Know It. <laughs> oh yeah. I went to the rec center the other day and uh, went to the change room and I got aqua-sized traumatized. <laughs> Ladies, I've got some bad news. The clam ages into a barnacle. <laughs> and that's when I realized there should be a legal age limit put on who is allowed laser hair removal. <laughs> Thank you guys so much.